Hello guys, my name is Sush and welcome back to a new video from Mustache. So in today's video, I'm going to be making a tiger. As you guys know, I made a tiger before in, in, like in the past. So I'll be making a new upload, updated one, a more graded one, which is like more detailed and it's more precisely shaped. So I'll be making a new one. And before I do so, make sure to like this video down. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. Uh, I just checked my channel analytics and I, I found out that my channel like the viewers are not subscribed most of them so i want that to change I, I hope you guys do so by clicking that red subscribe button down besides my channel name most of you guys might know that so please subscribe to it it's really appreciated i love it i increased a lot of subscribers since my latest two videos so i'm really really happy about it like i told my previous video and uh, let me know what to make in my future videos in the comment section and one more thing that I want to say to you guys is the Spinosaurus I made. It's actually not accurate. I'm really sorry about that. One of, one of my viewers just um, commented on my video saying that the Spinosaurus video is not as accurate. It's not not at all accurate actually. So guys, I made a uh, updated version of Spinosaurus. If, I, if you want, I can make that a video too of the new Spinosaurus Aegyplictus. I'm, not, I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Um, it's like a more aquatic version of the actual Spinosaurus it's more different so yeah let's get started with our actual video take a foil piece so we have a foil piece right here as you can see I use a uh, foil piece with this size I will leave the dimensions right here on top and now let's start making a tiger so I keep the uh, shape of the foil like this not like this actually I'm not like this. So I keep the uh, shape of the foil like this in a diamond shape. So this will be your tail and this will be a head. So I'm gonna start like this. Let's make the tail. Let's first make the tail. The tail should not be as long, but it should be almost it should be a little longer than the legs. So so I made the tail a little bit. Now it's I'll find it. So to make the tiger, we will need to do a lot of overlapping as the tiger is a pretty fat animal if you actually like look at it. So the tiger I made before wasn't actually as perfect, it was kind of slim in my opinion. So now uh, let's get back, we have the tail. Now let's divide this into a first leg. And divide this into a second one now let's leave this portion for the head as this we won't we'll actually overlap and add, add the head I'll just keep it like this for now so now let's make a tail of uh, uh, back legs and just Shaping up the tiger's body. I'll come a little closer. So now let's shaping up the tiger's body. As you can see, you can identify the shape right now. And there's room the tail. Now let's fold this back. Uh, this this is a special leg, basically animal legs. It's like folding back to a little bit and then comes back straight and goes down. So this is basically how animal legs are. As you can see, I'll give a bigger close up of that. So it's like folded back and then comes back like this. So yeah, now let's go on with the feet. Um, as you can see, we have the paws of the tiger. Now let's go to the second one. I'm going to be editing this video with shortcut. If you guys like it, I I actually edited my previous videos with shortcut. My last two videos since I moved to Australia. So. Um, I received a good uh, few positive, a uh, lot of positive feedback regarding my editing, so I'm really happy with that. So as you can see, it looks pretty good now. The back of the tiger. Um, now let's move on with the front. Let's straight this. I've seen a lot of foil videos on YouTube. Some that are really old, some that are really new. Um, most of them are really good, I, I think. Yeah, actually they all are good. I really like some of them. So let's move on with the second uh, front pause. 
as we did here let's make the front paw mm, yep and then let's go with the second front paw yep so guys we are now done with the body you can see how good it looks it looks really good as you can see it's kind of thin over here we should actually fatten it up a little bit the body looks perfect and otherwise look how perfect that looks uh, the legs look perfectly symmetrical and equal to the others and now as you can see I've led the head like this So now what we're going to do is we're going to be all adding some foil to this I'll take the foil in a moment So I'll take in the foil right here as you can see this is a rectangular piece of foil So what we're going to be doing now is I'm going to be taking a piece of part of it We'll leave that for later. We'll leave it and now let's cover this up and first let's molden up our lower, our lower jaw what's this? Mold, um, mold, mold our lower jaw and now let's make the upper jaw so guys a couple of friends had recently copied my channel and uploaded my videos in different ones so that was just a joke by then they had apologized later on so yep um, now we have made the front we have made the face now let's actually we made the upper jaw and the lower jaw now let's mold in this up yes and now let's actually take off this excess foil and just tear it off and throw it there and now Let's mold up the ears. So guys, as you can see now, the neck looks abnormally thin. So, as I told you, the foil that I had saved before, just fold it one time like this. And then I'm going to take this. And I think it's pretty long, too long for the neck. So I'm going to take one part of it. I might use this for the body or any other part. And I'm going to just... Uh, fold in this part like this as it uh, gets uh, thicker as as it goes and let's mold this and so I made the neck of the tiger it looks pretty nice it's roaring now let's take the part we had saved for our body and let's fold it one time like this and cover it we'll need more obviously we'll need more and let's overlap it one time for now and yeah, we are making the body more thicker so we have made we are done one we did one overlapping and now let's take some more foil and make the body more thicker so i've taken more pieces of foil one piece here i've taken more there let's hold this up oh my bad now let's Hold this up like I told before. Let's fold in the legs between the legs. Let's shape up the head a little bit, the face. Let's sh the shape of the top. Let's see. And as you can see, the body is like all crumbled up. So I'll just take a sheet of foil, simple sheet like this, fold it inside one time, and fold again inside, and just cover it up like this. Yep, as you can see, this uh, tiger took a lot of overlapping and now the body looks absolutely perfect compared to what a real tiger looks. Oh, I just did like that, I don't know why. So now let's move on with the neck. This is the, fi this is the final overlapping, in my opinion. This is the final overlapping.
and now let's straighten up the legs of the tiger so the and the tail and the feet and yep so there you guys have it a tiger a very nice looking tiger looks majestic much better than what i made before obviously because that time i was like pretty young now i'm like much older than that as you can see that's how we make a tiger you can pose it any way you want you can pose it it's it obviously stands uh, if you like pose it properly it'll stand if the legs are like straight so there you have it it stands perfectly so thank you guys for watching this video make sure to subscribe to my channel like i told before like this video if you like it and turn on the bell button obviously if i want to tell that turn on the bell button so you can know when i upload a video and as always bye bye and peace